Hey everyone! So today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to show you some very basic sounds that you can use to do your own beatboxing at home. Beatboxing is when people use their voice, their mouth, their breath sounds to try to sound like a drum machine. Now if you were in fifth grade music with me this year, this is something that we worked on back in the winter. In fact, I believe we had beatbox competitions in most of the fifth grade classes. So if some of these sounds or phrases sound familiar to, you, familiar to you, that's because we already did them in fifth grade this year. So I will warn you ahead of time, they don't make sense. They sound weird, they sound silly, but the words that we're using, the phrases that we're using aren't supposed to make sense. They're just to create some sounds, okay? So the key with this is to start slowly, and as you get more comfortable or you get better at saying the phrases, you can go a little faster and it'll sound more like beatboxing, okay? So the first phrase we're gonna use might sound familiar to you, and we're gonna use the words boots and cats, okay? So boots and cats. So I'm gonna start slowly and say it, and then as I get better at it, I will go faster. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and potato cats. Down here it says potato cats. Now I told you it doesn't make sense, okay? <laughs> Stick with me. Shh, nice and quiet, William. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and potato cats. I'm gonna go a little faster. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and potato cats. Now it still doesn't sound exactly like beatboxing. So we're gonna take it a step farther. And to make it sound a little bit more like beatboxing, we take the same phrase, boots and cats, but now we get rid of the vowel sounds. So no more O's in boots, no more A in cats, okay? So I'm gonna go slowly and I'm gonna say boots and cats, but without the vowel sounds. Here we go. So one more time. And the faster you go, the more like beatboxing it will sound. Okay? All right, I have one more example for you. Totally different phrase, different words. So you're going to get a little bit of a different sound. Okay? Again, it's not going to make sense. So the words for this one, dog, dog, keys, table, tea, baby, keys. Dog, dog, keys, table, tea, baby, keys. Dog, dog, keys, table, tea, baby, keys. Okay, I'm gonna go a little faster. Dog, dog, keys, table, tea, baby, keys. Dog, dog, keys, table, tea, baby, keys. Now we're gonna follow the same process and take out the vowel sounds. So here's that phrase about dogs and keys, but without the vowel sounds. I'm gonna go a little faster. Okay, so those are just two examples of how you can use words and phrases to make some beatboxing sounds. You could try making up your own phrase, see what kind of sounds you get, leave out the vowel sounds, and see if it sounds like beatboxing. Some of them might sound fun, some of them might not quite sound like beatboxing, but it'll still be fun to try. All right, I hope you enjoyed that. Have fun beatboxing, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.